Make sure you don't rub up against your mic now, because that's what makes it all fuzzy. Got it? Don't drop it. You're going up that way, I'll go up this way. Okay. You can't see. Hi, I'm Jordan. Hi, I'm Jordan too. Sorry, Eric. And together, we're the Jordans. You have to say it with me. Okay. And together. And together, we're, we're the, the Jordans. Jordans. The Jordans. The Jordans. The Jordans. So today, we're at the park, two houses down from our house, right? Yep. This is a new house we live at. Yep. So what do you think about this new house so far? I just like it is a little bit because there's parks everywhere. Exercise park, the park that we're at. And what? What is it? An exercise park? Yeah, the other one. That's Whoa, right. What is that about? So we have to do some exercise. Yeah. Just with your hands? A little bit with your hands. With your what? A little bit with your hands. Well, you could talk to me if you want, because I can't hear you when you're talking that way. But anyways, so we're preparing for Mother's Day, which is in a couple of weeks, right? Yeah. And we don't have a gift yet. So we're really trying to brainstorm some ideas that we can get mom. What do you think? Mm. Maybe mom really love, 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 love this. What? A bracelet and a necklace. What kind of bracelet? A heart one and a horse one. A horse one. See, those are awesome ideas because I thought you were going to say diamond. Like a diamond bracelet. And yeah, the, But the, if we just do a heart and horses one, that's way better, right? Yeah. Because diamonds are really expensive. And if we just cut like little pieces of horse legs off and then chop them up and put them in a necklace, that's what you mean? No. Oh, what do you mean? Because that would be free. We could do that. What kind of horse necklace? The necklaces that are already made. Like from the store? Yeah. Well, that's a good idea. What about, and, do you think, do you think moms like necklaces and things you buy at the store better or things that you make? I want to make something Well, I wasn't asking what you want to do. I was asking, you know, what do you think your mom likes, would like moms in general? Do you think that they would like maybe we you can to go make, to the store or do you think that she would like if we made her something? Uh, maybe we can make her something. I will make her bracelet and you can make the necklace. That's a good idea. So we make a necklace and bracelet instead of going to the store and buying one. So how do we make a necklace out of horses? Not horses. Oh, just like pictures of horses or yeah. shapes? Shapes of shapes horses. Of horses. <laughs> and then we put it in the box, wrap it around like a present. And then when it's Mother's Day, then we can give it to her. Then we can what? Then we can give it to her. Yeah, it's a good idea. What about like a song? What if we made her a song? We could just make her a song right now, don't you think? So like, we could start off by saying, Hey mom, it's the Jordans. And we wanna say happy Mother's Day. Hey mom, it's the Jordans. We love you in every single way. What else? We're making videos and everything that you like. And you even taught me how to ride my bike. You're the greatest mom. You're the best mom in the world. From the, the Jordans. Jordans. <laughs> That's pretty good. What about a different song? What, is, what does your mom teach you other than how to ride your bike? Does she teach you how to do other things? She, I taught myself how to swim. You taught yourself how to swim? She didn't teach you? No, I just taught myself. Did you just fall in one day? No. And you floated? No, I floated with my floaties. With your what? My floaties. How did you swim though? Did you float or did you? I, I just in the water. Like just with your hands? Yeah. That doesn't make you swim. That is not enough motion. And for my you to legs. Swim. And your legs. Okay. I was going to say, dude, you will sink if you ever try to do that again. So I would not approve of you swimming that way. But if you're going to use your legs, 
hey, man, that's a whole different ball game, right? Because mm -hmm. your legs are way stronger than your upper body. But we're getting way distracted right now. We're talking about mom. So you taught yourself how to swim, which had nothing to do with the question I asked you, which was, what does your mom help you with? She helps me how to make stuff like bracelets. Like bracelets? So and necklaces. So your mom could even make her own horse bracelet and she wouldn't even know. So that way you're like actually saving a lot of time. You could have her make her own horse and heart bracelet and then wrap it up and say, here you go, mom. Hope you like it. Do you think that'd be a good idea? Maybe I, I think you, me and you can make it. You think we could do it? Yeah. Yeah, you're probably right. We probably do a better job than mom, right? So mom can help you make bracelets, but we don't really want mom to help you make quality bracelets. Because if we want them to be done really, really good, then we just do them ourselves, right? Yeah. Like that. Like this? Yeah. I didn't, I didn't make this though. Yeah. This is about, this is about God and Jesus dying on the cross. So that's a whole nother video. We won't. This is the blood. That is the blood. Yep. She carried you inside her for nine months. Can you believe that? Do you know how long nine months is? Almost as long to your next birthday. Do you realize that hurts when you pull my hair? <laughs> yeah, it's not, it's not like, you know, that doesn't feel good. Right? <laughs> this is real hair here. I know I don't have much up here. But this does count. It's still real hair. It does not hurt. No, it, it does isn't. not feel good when you pull. <laughs> Just saying. Um, I have this hair. Yeah. I could pull. <laughs> Got it. Um. So, what were we talking about? Uh, Mom. Oh yeah. Nine months you were in her belly, so her belly was really skinny. You know, her belly's super skinny, and it got like this big. Oh. You were just in there doing somersaults peeing all over the place. Did you know that? And no. eating all the food she ate, you ate it all. You didn't share with her anything. No, I didn't. So, what do you think you I, could I tell? ate the brownies that she, she made. The brownies, yeah, but you didn't really get to choose. Anyways, so what do you have to say to her for carrying you around in her belly? Can you imagine carrying your big old head in your own belly? How uncomfortable <laughs> will that be? How would you button your pants? How would you go poop? It would be like sitting down like this. <laughs> You'd almost be pooping this way. It'd be hard to poop down because your belly hits your knees, right? Yeah. <laughs> Just hold it. So what do you say to her to thank her for that? I don't know. You could tell her because she's probably going to watch this. We might have to cut a few things out. Yeah. You know, it's kind of weird. I don't want to. You don't want to tell her thank you? Thank you for what? For carrying you around in her belly. I don't like it. I don't want to say thank you. That was weird, huh? Yeah. It's kind of a weird analogy to understand at the age of five. It is kind I of... I was one. Well, I mean, you're five now. So you're trying to understand being inside your mom's belly. It's pretty gross, right? Yeah. So you don't What if you were in mom's belly? I wouldn't thank her either, you know? <laughs> I think that'd be really, really uncomfortable. And I don't want to count on her deciding what I eat. Sometimes, you know, I just have to put my foot down there, you know. What if you were in Cadence's belly? In Cadence's belly? <laughs> yeah. I don't think I even want to imagine that. So, anyways, um, what do you think mom would like to do for Mother's Day? <gasps> Ding! Ding! So, I was thinking about making a treat. No, no, we're, we already talked about making things. What would she like to do? I think yesterday mom said that she wanted to go swimming. So maybe we can blow up a pool. But if we blow up the pool, how would we go swimming in it? Wouldn't it be destroyed? No. No, it wouldn't. Because I think about this for a minute. If we go down, let's say, to this guy's pool right here and we blow it up, nobody's going swimming because it's blown up. You just blow it up? Do you have dynamite? No. Fireworks? No. How are you going to blow up a pool? You don't even know how to work a lighter, do you? Daddy, we can use a blow up thing. A blow up machine. You have a machine that blows things up? What? No, it's a blower that blows the pools oh, up. Oh, blow it up like air. <laughs> Sorry. 
I thought you meant like with explosions. Yeah, you just and mean then... like a blow up pool. So you think your mom would like that? A little blow up pool for her, for Mother's Day? And then we can make one of those covered chocolate strawberries and ice cream. You know what? On... That's the best idea I've heard all day. Yeah. Because I love. And then ice cream on top of blueberries. On top of blueberries. My mouth's watering right now. Is your mouth watering? No. And it's not? My, my spit is food with, my, my mouth is food with spit. Yeah, that's basically the same thing. But that kind of makes my mouth not water now that you said it that way. It's kind of gross. Yeah. <laughs> so how do you, how, what's the process look like for us making chocolate covered strawberries? Where do we begin? What do we do so, first? Let's not put it down on the ground. Just hold it. I'll hold it. So, what we're gonna do, so, get the mixer, get chocolate first, pour it in a bowl, get the mixer, mix it up, or, and then wait it, wait, put it outside so it can get melty, and then dip the, the chocolate strawberries in there. Because just like the peanut butter melt. So how long does it normally take for outside to make chocolate melty? Maybe nine minutes. Nine minutes. Yeah, I guess that would probably make sense if it's in the middle of the summer. It gets pretty hot in Arizona. Yeah. So do we have? Do you think we should cover it up at all? Mm, just the tip. Just the tip? Yeah. Cause that's what the... is the tip of a bowl, though? What is that? So you get a strawberry. Do this until it gets on the tip. Oh, I'm talking about plate. should we cover up the chocolate while it's outside? No, no, sit down. We have to finish our video. Oh. We ran, we ran out of memory card space. Yeah. So just stopped our video just like that. I mean, how inconvenient. So we have to sign off now and go find out how we can find more.